What's up and welcome to today's vlog. Decided to start out the room tour in the backyard. We've got our own little uh, private pool, it's super cool. Over there we've got like our own little, it's like a hammock. It's super nice, we've actually, Aswin and I have laid out there the past two nights and just like relax, it's super nice over there. Walks out straight to the ocean, this is the beach right here. A little table to sit at and then we've got the two um, chairs for laying out we've got an outdoor shower right there and I'll show you the inside so this is the inside of our bedroom we've got a little uh, desk area over there over here there's like a little uh, cubby like cutout thing that's got like a that's pretty much like its own bed got a TV this is the front door back here this is like the off or not the office this is the closet plus like a little get ready area and then right here is the bathroom it's an outdoor bathroom which you guys have seen in our vlogs before we've been to a few different places with outdoor bathrooms outdoor shower right here here's another shower that's like indoors toilet sink bathtub so yeah that's a little uh room tour of our little villa here at the sun aqua Velu reef at the resort here in the maldives so so now we are about to go out and do a little photo shoot you look cute aspen's got some clothes on that she wants to go shoot so we have been here for two days now and we have zero vlog footage because we have just been relaxing laying around we swam in our pool today hi guys so i'm interrupting the vlog really quick to let you guys know i'm doing a meetup in new york city on june 16th from 4 to 6 p.m at the saint ives mixing bar i'm gonna put all the info in the description but I wanted to let you guys know I posted about it on Twitter and Instagram and stuff but I wanted to just do a quick little like voiceover thing in this vlog to tell you guys so comment down below and let me know if you guys can make it we got massages today and we are just in paradise but now we are gonna go shoot some photos so I have on this cute new top from Urban that I'll link down below I have on my go-to necklaces and then these shorts we have restocked these like four times and they always three times maybe and they always sell out in like 10 minutes so you guys should go to if you guys follow luca and gray my online clothing store on instagram you should turn on the post notifications because we always post like when we restock them then you'll be the first to know so yeah we're just taking some pictures now i have my cute urban purse got my cameraman over there this is such a pretty walkway to take pictures in and we are back in the room. Outfit change. I'm wearing this cute stripy dress and a swimsuit from our store. I also curled my hair because my hair is at the length where if I just let it air dry, the bottom like flips out. And then I look like a freaking mushroom. I really like my hair this length when I actually like do it and curl it. But I don't know if I'll keep it this short because I'm just not a person who does their hair unless they're like filming a video. Parker showing me exactly how he wants his picture. Are you looking? Yep. Exactly like this. Okay. We just got done shooting. We only needed two outfits. We're gonna have to do more tomorrow, but we are packing up our room because we are actually switching. So we have been in this little villa with our pool that is on the beach, and then now we are going to be in one of the overwater villas the like bungalows so that we can get some cool pictures in those okay guys so we're at dinner now they have like a nice uh buffet restaurant over here so this is where we have been coming for most of the meals because it's pretty easy so tonight they have did you hear what style of food they said this was maldivian i think Oh, is that what they said? Well, the, like, Mal it's Maldivian chicken. So these are the two new things that I got to try. I got some pasta too, and then I have three little things of passion fruit. Passion fruit is so freaking good. And I have some fruit. Should be pretty yummy. Okay, update. The food is amazing. Out on what this stuff is, I think they said it was doll, right? Dog, yeah. Dog? <laughs> they said it was doll, which I haven't had before. Are you talking about this? Yeah. Is it really good? It's so good, and the potatoes are good. Like, they look good, but it was supposed to be better. We are filming a few questions on the vlog channel. We just barely did a Q&A on my channel, so if you guys want to check it out and get a bunch of answers to a bunch of other questions, check the link down below. Click the card, go to my channel, watch that video. We answered a lot of questions about the store, about life, about babies. Go check that out. Who's the laziest of you two? I think we were talking about this the other day. I feel like both of us are like really uptight about things, totally different things, and both of us are really lazy about things. Yeah. Different things. So like cleaning, Aspen's very lazy about that, and she'll like- You're just a lot more uptight. Well, I'm just like, 
Parker's just likes to always have everything be like well, super Well, let's clean. just put it this way. If there's ever a mess in our house, who would you say it is 99% of the time? It's mine. It's always mine. So that's just you, I guess in a way, being lazy and not yeah. cleaning it up right after you make the mess. Like where yeah. I, if I make a mess, I'll clean it up as soon as I make the mess. But I don't know, I guess that that's a different type of lazy, I don't know. Yeah, I feel like Parker's lazy like in just like different ways. But I want to say overall one of us is just like completely more lazy than the other. Do you feel like life passes by without noticing because you're away from home so often? I do feel like there are like a lot of things that we miss out on at home, but I also think that it's like, worth it to be where we yeah, are. Yeah, like we're we're experiencing life in a whole other way, and it's so yeah. cool, and I love it. But I feel like it does make it hard. Like my family's in town right now; they just got there like yesterday. So and like I we haven't seen her family here. for a couple weeks. Yeah. So like we would be sitting and Parker's hanging out. family's in town. Like both of our families. Yeah, in town, my sister. And his yeah. Sister is pregnant and they what they, they they do a gender reveal like i don't think they did like a party but they like figured out what they're having and told everyone yeah. and like we're not there we're missing it and like yeah. my family's here or there so like we're so grateful to be here but sometimes it does feel like we're missing out on stuff yeah. i swear like the past like three or four times that his sister and her husband came into town it was like they either came like right after we left or like they came and we left the next day yeah same with my family they've been down like two or three times and we've been gone every time yep so sometimes yeah so yeah when it comes to family yeah. What country would you recommend we visit? What What are some country recommendations? I really like Barcelona. I thought it was really cool. Yeah? Barcelona. Since we're talking about places that she's been and I haven't, I thought that Amsterdam was really, so the Netherlands, it was like really, really clean. Because Amsterdam kind of has the rep of like, like weed shops everywhere and the red light district. So you kind of get this vibe that it's like, maybe like dirty gross, or something, yeah. gross, you know? But like, it was super clean, very well kept, very like modern very nice like a lot of young hip people like it was it was a really cool nice place where do you see yourself in 10 years so That's I would be so 20 how old am I no I would be 31 I'd be, 32. be 32 did we talk about your birthday no we didn't it was Parker's birthday yeah I turned 22 in it like three days ago on the 7th yeah so during the 7th that ended up being like our travel day so we went from Singapore to here so we celebrated but we were like on a plane all day so we still have been kind of celebrating here but we're gonna officially celebrate once we get back home just so we can like do family and everything yeah but yeah Parker turned 22 um I'm feeling 22 on his 22nd birthday he was in the Maldives on his 21st birthday he was in New York at a Beyonce concert and on his 20th birthday he was in the Bahamas it's been like a really good past Number three days. years yeah but I like I'm ready to be home for a birthday to be honest. I know yeah <laughs> I think we had like two years that my we were gone for my birthday too and then this year we were home and I had the best birthday ever and so yeah we are gonna celebrate when we get home do you ever regret not going on a mission if you guys haven't been following us for a while a couple years ago Parker was going to go on a church mission which is like a two-year thing so it's very long and it's very strict so it's not really the same it's just like a service trip that like some other people go on it's like you can't have a phone or anything like that you can like email your family once a week it's like a very and write letters thing write letters but um and you're just out for two years in yeah. some cases in a foreign country in some cases you're still in the states but you're just like doing service for people and you're it's like a church thing. yeah you're trying to convert people to the church do i regret not going no i don't i feel like if over these past two years like i was just doing nothing and just like sat at home maybe i would regret it but over these past two years like i've traveled so much and i've experienced so much and i've grown so much as a person i feel like everything that i've done kind of out ways and I don't regret it. So yeah, apparently we're going scuba diving today. Scuba diving? Like we're actually going like with the tanks and like going underwater, like deep underwater. I'm excited. So we'll bring the GoPro. That's it for the little Q&A portion of today's vlog. We'll also give you guys a little room tour. So this is where we were just sitting out here. I love these chairs. They're so comfy. We have a pool. I guess I'll go out here to show you guys. Super beautiful. We have a nice deck. And then over here we have a super Super cool hammock. We got into this room last night, so we didn't have a chance to sit on this yet, but I'm so excited. Prettiest view. And then if you come, oh, and then we have like stairs going down to the water. The water is such a cool color. It's so pretty. So then you go back in here. Here's like the bed and everything. And then there's a comfy little place over there. 
TV. There's more doors. And then this is what it looks like from over here. I really like this color combination. I think it's really cute. So then this is the bathroom. Nice bathtub, shower, toilet, all that. And then this door I think leads outside. Yeah, so this closet or this thing like wraps around. And that's our room. <laughs> Diving. I was going to also scuba dive with him. I really wanted to try it, but I don't even like to snorkel, so I don't know what I was thinking. I always try to be adventurous, even if it's a little tiny adventure, like going on a bike ride or something at home. But oh my gosh, the guy was like explaining to us, like, okay, so you do this and this and this, and blah, blah, blah. And I like felt like I could not breathe and we weren't even doing anything yet. I was like so stressed out. And then I had to do like, try and breathe with the thing. And I, oh my gosh, I like literally I was having so much anxiety. I was like, okay, I cannot do it. Like I just cannot do water. Like I will swim in a pool. I will swim in like shallow water like this in the beach or I'll be like in the middle of the ocean if I have a life jacket on, but I cannot like do snorkeling or scuba diving. I was like freaking out. I was so stressed out. I feel so much better now. So I'm enjoying relaxing up here. <laughs> They're practicing here and then later in the day, we're gonna go on a boat and that's when you like actually do it for real. They're all the way under the water now, right there. And I'm just relaxing. Look how cute that pink boat is. But there's a cute little like deck over here. So I'm just hanging out, enjoying myself up here. How was it? It was so cool. Like, yeah? Yeah, I'm like, I want to get scuba certified now. We are now about to go out and shoot this swimsuit of mine. This really cute one piece that I got from Nordstrom. I'm going to be doing a bunch of like blog posts because we've been taking a bunch of pictures. I need to figure out, I have like the email sign up thing on my blog, but I don't think it's actually connected to anything. So you guys should uh, go to my blog down below, aspenover.com, sign up for the emails, and then I'll get that figured out so that when I do a post, then you get an email and you can see it. Or you can just follow me on like Twitter or Instagram because I always say when I post. I've been trying to post a lot more on my blog. I feel like I say that all the time, but I have been doing it. Yeah. So we are about to go take some pictures. I have like a million bug bites and I haven't washed my face today and I'm itchy. I think that we've washed our faces ugly. once in like the past Three five, six days. days. Yeah, six, okay, I lied. <laughs> six days. We've just been relaxing. Like we, it's been so nice because in Singapore we were just go, go, go. And I love trips like that. Like I like to feel productive. Yeah. So when we come here, like we had three full days here and that for us is like perfect. Cause if we were just sitting around doing like nothing, relaxing for like a week, I feel like, I mean, I'm not gonna say I wouldn't like it cause who can complain about that? But we just like to be like really productive and like out doing stuff and seeing stuff. Kind of forgot where I was going with that. Anyways, oh, so we've been relaxing, but also still like taking pictures and stuff, which is something we like to do. I actually have brought a bunch more outfits that I wanted to shoot, but. Did you tell him how I went scuba diving again? Yeah, Parker went scuba diving. Uh... Super cool GoPro montage now. <laughs> take pictures now yeah there's a, a really cool hammock right here that we want to take pictures on so we're headed out there now hey. 